I am the walking phone book. Ooh. You guys may be asking, why on earth do you call yourself the walking phone book? Well, before you comment or shut down this video, give me three minutes to explain the scenario. With up to 522 contacts in my cell phone, you guys may be asking, well, why do you have so many contacts? Well, you guys may be think that I have a pretty big uh, family and friends group, which that I do have, yes. But did you know that 300, that over 300 of my 500 contacts of my 522 contacts are numbers to restaurants, stores, hotels, airline businesses, and ski resorts? Before you guys shut down or close this video, just give me three minutes to explain why I have the phone numbers to so many businesses. Number one. Number one. Being prepared. As a YouTuber, and with all the experiences I have with traveling, eating out, shopping, and other things, including touring places, why go scrambling for the phone number when you can already have it? For an example, people spend a lot of time searching for phone numbers People spend countless hours and minutes going on Google and typing up phone numbers and searching for them. And my answer is, why go scrambling for phone numbers when you can already have them? And for an example, if, I, if there's ever an emergency, like if there's a fire or I need police, I have the phone number to the Coeur d'Alene Fire Department and the police station, just in case that happens. So, and then, in case I need to get the business hours to, let's say, a restaurant, or a store, or the post office, or that stuff, I got the phone numbers to that thing. I also have the phone numbers to all the departments in Costco, just in case I need to call them. And... And... I have the phone numbers to hotels to get information on Wi-Fi, pools, continental breakfast, etc., etc. I also have the phone numbers to several customer service reps. Ones that I probably won't need to, need to use, but I will probably, I may need to in the future. Number two. There's good reasoning. If I'm traveling, let's say to... I also have the phone numbers to a lot of airports and subway and metro customer service reps. In case I'm going to, I also have the phone numbers to several airlines. The reason I do that is because in case I need, let's say, to cancel bookings, to figure something out, or to learn COVID requirements, I have the toll-free 1-800 phone numbers to several airlines, including Delta Airways, including Delta Airlines, Qatar Airways, Korean Air, United Airlines, Lufthansa, British Airways, Egypt Air, Malaysia Airways, Emirates, Kenya Air, and many more. And I have those numbers handy. And number three, in case I'm going on guided tours, I have the phone numbers to three different tour companies including Colette Travel, which we almost always see in Wheel of Fortune, 
and G Adventures, which is a well-known tour company. I've never used them before, but I have the phone number to them in case I decide to go on a guided tour someday. And I also have the phone number to Explorica, which is the same thing. Number three, the most important one. I believe being prepared and having the phone numbers coming handy is a lot better than just going on the internet, wasting countless time, wasting your phone's battery life, searching for phone numbers that you could already have. So, yeah, those are the reasons I just thought I'd share that with you guys. Uh, I hope you guys are having a great summer. And before I get off the camera, look at what I'm standing by. I'm standing by Fernand Lake, which this lake is nice to look at, but it's dangerous to swim in in August. There's, it's actually a deep green right now. I don't know if you guys can see it, but I can see it. It's a deep green. There's toxic algae in it. So if you jump in it, it could give you a rash. But anyway, don't forget to subscribe.